Hello world, meet your newest college grad. I've got a major in art history and a minor in 19th century courting rituals. It's time to hit the job market. So not everybody gets or wants their degree in engineering or pharmacology. Some people are more focused on finding themselves and <clears throat> expanding their minds. If that sounds like you, then the 2016 Scion IM might be the car of your dreams. itself is advertising this car as the free-spirited brother of the IA. If the IA is in finance, then the IM is into making experimental silent films featuring an all-animal cast. And as you can see, the exterior styling reflects that. Powering the IM is a 1.8 liter four-cylinder engine that produces 137 horsepower and 126 pound-feet of torque. Considering the IM isn't exactly light, weighing in at around 3,000 pounds, that doesn't seem like it's going to be enough to have too much fun with. You're going to be able to find a lot of other cars in this segment that give you more from a performance standpoint. For a small car, cargo space isn't too bad. You'll find 21 cubic feet at the back and loads more when you fold the seats down. You'll get decent passenger space too, as the tally for that is 91 cubic feet. So that's the IM's exterior. So let's see what the interior has to offer. So the first thing you're gonna notice when you get inside the IM is that the interior is of a quality for a car much more expensive than this one. One of the biggest selling points for the IM is how many standard features you get. Eight airbags, a leather wrapped steering wheel, dual climate zones, keyless entry, a rear view monitor, touchscreen display, and power folding mirrors. So while the IM skimps on power, it makes up for it with everything that it gives you standard. The driver's gauges are lit nicely and everything's very visible and it's just, again, the, the key with this car seemed to be simplicity and simplicity is exactly what they got. So as you can hear, when you accelerate, that CVT is gonna be going lots of noise again and it's not the quietest thing, we all know that. So the acceleration for this car, you're gonna get zero to 60 in about nine, nine and a half seconds. And you know, it looks sporty, but looks can be deceiving. The steering feels a little bit numb. There's, you know, it's not as tight as maybe you would think a car like this should be but the cornering is actually surprisingly good. It handles itself nicely in just regular everyday traffic. It's a comfortable car to drive and you actually don't feel like you're sitting too low. It would make a good daily driver. It's not gonna have the quickness some people might desire, but if you're looking for a pretty inexpensive car that you can use every single day, I mean, this is gonna be a good, a good choice. Okay, so maybe that degree in art history isn't exactly going to be buying you a Tesla right out of college. And in hindsight, those 19th century courting rituals classes were probably a bit of a waste. But that's okay, because the 2016 Scion IM is here for you. So if you ever actually do find yourself, take yourself down to a Scion dealer and take the new IM and its impressive amount of standard equipment for a test spin. Unless, of course, that's too mainstream for you.